Maybe the best way to avoid headaches is to find ways around them. That'll be true for the West Avenue Bridge in Jackson. MDOT is closing the bridge that goes over the railroad tracks this week. Your detour, however, may also create a headache for businesses in the area. Steve Doty has more. Sitting next to a torn up road and a pile of orange barrels is Roxy Cafe. Well, we just celebrated our 37th year, April 1st. Business is steady on a Monday afternoon, but that could be changing. We are anticipating soon to be closing the M50 West Avenue Bridge in Jackson. I do think it might have a little, little negative effect, especially during the week. Add the additional construction down Ganson Street and sales could drop significantly this summer. We're there just one construction season doing both of these projects. We anticipate the M50 West Avenue Bridge to be closed um, through August. I'm standing here on Wildwood, one of the streets marked as a detour during the construction process this summer, but local residents in this area aren't too thrilled about the potential increase in traffic. I dread it. It's needed. The, the renovations are needed, but I dread the problems it creates. Ann Diamond has lived and worked out of her home just four doors down from Wildwood for 50 years and isn't looking forward to people cutting down her streets. I'm looking forward getting done. How's that? MDOT says the West Avenue Bridge is one of the older structures left to be fixed and the construction this summer will only benefit the drivers. Once that bridge reopens, we'll be improving safety on the bridge by improving sight distance. Um, it won't be quite so crested or curved. But the added safety does come with the risk of Roxy Cafe losing business. But Jim Serrata says he'll find something to do if business slows down. Maybe we'll enjoy our summer a little bit more. I'm going to get on the motorcycle. In Jackson, Steve Doty, Fox 47 News. And as we mentioned, the bridge is expected to be closed by the end of the week. Engineers are working out traffic light timing right now. Work on Ganson Street is expected to wrap up by the end of July.